with Elizabeth and her family and we're just going to be tourists and hang out. over to Amalfi and we're just gonna play tourists for the day and then we're gonna go have lunch at Da Teresa before it closes for the winter. We've got dogs and children and it's not ideal but um very interesting with the museum there museum of the campus and also shows you the boats that they built for the regatta when it gets too busy is to duck down an alleyway and um, immediately it will be quieter better. The trouble is it looks like it's all closed so it looks like we're gonna sit down you're such a good girl I think the reason why it is so busy in a mouthy is that giant cruise ship out there. Must have brought about 2,000 people into town. Right, I think we're going to slowly make our way over to Da Teresa so the kids can be let loose on the beach. Ooh, look, there's a classic car show here. Let's have a look. There's a gathering of Alfa Romeo spiders on the seafront. Very nice. Here comes our boat! And that's better on the beach. Somebody's having a little tantrum down there. <laughs> we have arrived here just in time for lunch. It's really quiet here at the moment obviously because we are mid-October I think they're going to close next week so it is at the moment just us when we come to dinner here we don't normally ask for a menu they just bring food and it's the best it's just a mix there's a lot of fresh fish vegetables and you never know what you're gonna get Wow. wow. Grazie. So we're just choosing our desserts. So this is from the famous Sal di Riso pasticceria in Maiori. It's a seven bales cake. Yum. We also have tiramisu. So we made lemon cake. A little delizia limone and pear and ricotta okay it's time for the kiddies to have a little sleep and i'm gonna take a little walk down the end of the beach because there's a little arch down the end there and then there's like an old fishing man's uh i don't know what the word is cave really let's go have a look these stones are not easy to walk on barefoot. I'm glad I've got my shoes on today. And through to the oops, through to the other side. And we have this huge cave with a bar in it. <laughs> These boats have been here for years. It's incredible. 
great storage area though. Wouldn't mind a garage like this with ruins in it. Look at that. I'm not gonna lie, I feel a little bit spooked out being in here on my own. Okay, let's go out of here. I just had a little nap, didn't mean to, but um, I lay down listening to a podcast and fell asleep for about an hour. Anyway, I'm awake now, the sun's gone in, it's gone a bit cloudy and I think we're going to go back to Pantasano soon. Yeah. 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 Penny, step down the glassy ball. Penny, what are you doing? You can't sit on Rosie. <laughs> no. We have Captain Laney taking us into port. Yeah, Captain. <laughs> it was a little bit of a bumpy ride back, but we're back safe. And I'm just wasting about half an hour because um, I'm going to go pick up Cardo and we're going to go home. So I'm just coming for a little walk in this little new town square that you might not have seen yet. They've been building it for a few years, but it's done now. I've sort of done it the wrong way around because that's where people sit. But I reckon that's where the stage should be with the town behind it. But um, yeah. Okay, so I've escaped from the beach. I'm now at Le Palati, just waiting to pick up Carlo because it's just about the right time that he's finishing work so we can go up home together. And I think we'll probably stop off and grab a little bit of food to make something for dinner tonight. I have no idea what I'm gonna do. The view from where we park the scooters really isn't too shabby. Look at that. I really need to get a new helmet. This one is, uh, this was, this is a child's helmet. So this was Skye's when she was little. It's really, really tiny. Um, Carlo's, weirdly enough, the only one that actually fits okay. So he gets to wear that. Where is he? So Carlo's just okay. come down. He's been having a chat with this lovely lady with a bunch of bougainvillea. Yeah. Just got down most of the steps. There's a lovely pink sunset happening. I always miss it. I'm always climbing down steps when it's sunset time. Time to go and have a cup of tea. 